Hey, New Mexico, it's Bob sitting here in the Coke Lounge with Teresa Schmitz, girl with a big voice. How does it feel to be part of this whole contest? Oh, it's exciting. I'm having a lot of fun. It's not really knowing what's going on, you know, and kind of figuring it out as we go and um, meeting new people and just the experiences. Well, this is the first exciting. day, right? First day where you all came first together day, uh -huh. and got to meet each other. And were, were you intimidated at all? Yeah, I mean, you know, the funny thing is, um, me and some of the girls keep meeting up everywhere we go, so right. it's it's neat to see them. But um, so this isn't the, your first rodeo, so to speak. No, you know we're kind of battling it out, but <laughs> in love, <laughs> in a loving way. Yes. Now, how did you get started in music? Um, well, the funny thing is, um, my parents like to tell the story of when I was five years old. My dad was a youth pastor in a Spanish church, um, and I kind of jumped on stage following some Spanish singers. I had no idea how to speak Spanish, and so I started mumbling a bunch of very random things and embarrass my parents. Um, and then later on in a talent show, actually, I just wanted to join the talent show and decided I would try piano just because I wanted to get out there and try something. And um, after embarrassing myself in front of them for the, the tryouts, if you will, um, I decided the next day I would just try to sing. And I found a soundtrack and then ever since fourth grade. That, that launched it, that got it in the bloodstream. Yeah, don't know how that happened, but hmm. it worked for me. Well, they say once it gets in your blood, you can never get rid of it. Now, do you have aspirations where you want to go with your career? Do you have a direction in mind of where you'd like to end up? I do. I would, I would love to be, you know, I, I, look, I look up to best singers. I mean, there's Mariah Carey, Whitney Houston, you know, they're amazing. But um, I'd love to be there one of these days. Um, this Concert theater. performer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, do you have a job right now that you're, you're working at to support all this crazy madness in music? Well, I work part-time um, in a pharmacy, and a pharmacy? Um, I'm a student full-time, um, but my husband is actually the one that's working and supporting us. He's an officer with APD. Oh, wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, that's Teresa.